Hi and welcome to the first in a short series of videos that I'll be making to explain some of the more difficult things that crafters have been coming back with. Uh, today we'll be first doing image uploading. So here you'll see the main crafter login page. So if you want to log in, you go here, type in your details. and click here and here you'll see the main dashboard to add images we need to go into product edit and here I've got a few test products that have been disabled they're not visible in the store but we'll go into this one and add some images to it so images are found at the bottom if you can't see this control or you can't see specifically these two buttons this will mean that your flash may not be working on your computer or that you're using a smartphone that does not support flash. Uh, so if you're using a smartphone, I'd advise using a desktop and making sure that your flash is up to date or at least installed. Uh, and if you can see these, you should be able to add images. So we'll go in. First of all, you have to browse files, pick an image and upload. So you'll see here, roll over here and you can see a preview of the image that you've uploaded. You can add more files. So I'll add this. You can add two at a time. But don't add two in the same pop-up window. So if we choose, say for example, this one, or these two, we can do. If we choose these two, try to open them, you'll see that there's an error. So we can remove them again. And we'll try one of these. And now we click Upload Files, and they'll work away, you can see. See, there was a problem with one of the logos, so we can try that again. That is this one, no, it doesn't seem to like that one. likes this one. So this means that your file must be in a JPEG format for it to work. The one that I tried to upload was in PNG format, ping, and it wouldn't upload correctly. But you can see here that these are loading away and uploading. So the most important thing here is to make sure that you haven't selected this no image line as your thumbnail, small image, and base image. These are used for the product listings uh, and from within your, your product. So you need to set these to the specific pictures that you want displayed for your product. So here we will set this first one to all three. Uh, if we leave it on no image, it will mean that this image here will be displayed this is the base image for Diamond Crafts. It's just so that it doesn't show up blank and it just sort of keeps a coherence with the rest of the products. Uh, but you want to have shown off your image as best as possible. So you need to select these three. So once done, you can go to save. That'll work away for a short time. And it'll go back to this screen my product screen. You'll see the product has been saved. So hopefully when we go back in here, we will go down to the bottom and here are our images. And as you can see, all set. And that's basically how you upload your images. If there's any questions with that, 
get back to us at info at Thanks.